Morrison's Chicken Hot Pot is the subject of today's Food for Thought video. My name is Jodie Bunting and this is another one of our daily health tips to help you lose weight. Now today I'd like to share with you this great, 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 especially if you're on a budget meal, by Morrison's. So it's in the M Morrison's Frozen section and this is called a counted meal, uh, which is part of the calorie controlled ready meals in the freezer section. Uh, and this one today is the chicken hot pot, which is just 257 calories. Now, I don't know about you, but when I think 250 calories, I think like tiny, like tiny little meal, but no, it is this box the size of my head. That's how big it is, guys. So that's the good news. Um, low in fat, which is not always a good thing, uh, but obviously, uh, for the calorie-wise, that's why it is so low. It is a good source of protein, it's saying. So it doesn't say, oh no, it does say high in protein. Uh, and then it also says as well, source of fiber. So when, when things say source of, and not high, it means there is some in there, but there's not a lot, okay? So do look out for that, guys. So it's not high in fiber, but it is a source of fiber, which means it's got a little bit, but it does say the word high when it says fiber. Uh, so this is the ready meal. Um, let me just give you some more nutritional information before we dig in and taste it, because of course I've got it here. It smells amazing. Um, for those of you who've never shopped in the counted range in Morrison's, they're all 99p. It's just genius, genius. I don't know how they do it. Um, they sell loads, that's how they do it. Um, so per pack, 257 calories. It's got five grams of fat, 30 grams of carbs. So for those of you who are on 50 grams of carbs on the long-term keto, low carb, this is actually, that'll squeeze in, no problem. Th only 30 grams. Uh, fiber, 5.4 grams and protein. 19.8 grams of protein. I am loving that. Uh, and for those of you who are looking to live more of a holistic lifestyle, uh, just remember having potatoes is much healthier than going for things like pasta and bread, guys. So if you do want some carbs in your diet, we are British, remember? Uh, so go for potatoes, which is a local f source. Um, and as I said, when it's only 257 calories, you can definitely eat your carbs. So Shall we just see the ingredients? I really want to eat it because it looks so good. It's hot next to me. Let me bang through the ingredients, guys, because I know you guys like to know. So the official uh, description of a chicken hot pot is cooked chicken breast strips and vegetables in gravy and saute potatoes. Does that sound bet like Betty's Hot Pot from uh, Coronation Street to you? So the ingredients, biggest ingredient is water, sauteed potatoes, 21%, which is also potato, sunflower oil and dextrose. If you don't know what dextrose is, it's sugar. So those potatoes are gonna taste amazing. Uh, and that's not in a good way. Uh, chicken breast, 17%. In that chicken breast is chicken breast, corn flour and salt, not bad. At least it's not really processed. And the, also in the ingredients list is onion, carrot, peas, tomato, swede, great, corn flour, tomato juice, fortified wheat flour. Why do they have to put that crap in everything? Uh, the fortified wheat flour is wheat flour, calcium, carbonate, iron, uh, thinine. So basically they've tried to add some nutrients in there. Uh, then the next ingredient is sugar. The next ingredient is yeast extract. So one of my slimmer Sam, she's she can't eat yeast. So sorry, Sam, not for you. Uh, gum fiber flavorings, which is never, if unless it says natural flavorings, then that's not good. Chicken extract, salt, parsley, thyme, and caramelized sugar. Caramelized sugar. <laughs> But either way, even though it's got a few dodgy ingredients in there, guys, to get that for 257 calories, I am really impressed. And as I said, it's one of those meals for 99p. You can bang it in your freezer and just have it ready just in case. You come home from teaching a class like me and you're absolutely ravenous. So this is the uh, finished product. <laughs> I'm just trying not to burn myself. I'm just taking the lid off. Uh, without burning myself. And this is it, guys. So this is, is uh, the Morrison's Counted Chicken Hot Pot. Now, first thing you'll notice is the thing that I'm noticing now 
is this dish is only half full. So that is slightly disappointing. Uh, for those of you who have the Slimming World meals, which have been copycatted by a lot of the uh, supermarkets, they're one ninety nine and they're really big. Um, so I would recommend if you are having this uh, and you like to eat big portions of food, then maybe this is uh, something that you need to add something to. Uh, but for 257 calories, I'm excited. What I am going to do, I think, is just stir it around a little bit because I want to check out the ingredients inside. And as I do that, guys, I can see that most of this is potato. Look, there's hardly actually any chicken and there's not much veg. It's a lot of potato. Um, but for 257 calories, what do you expect? Right, let's give this a try. I'll let you have a look why I chew. Nice. You know what? After reading out the ingredients, I can actually taste the sugar. I can actually taste that that gravy is sweet. Sort of in a good way, but health wise, that's bad. <laughs> Let me have another piece, guys, because I didn't get any chicken. So that's the bit of chicken. Right, so that is really nice. So if you're short of time, if you're short of money, you need nutrients. It's not ideal, but certainly would help you stop eating processed food, fast food, and certainly cheaper than takeaways. So that was the counted range by Morrison's, 257 calories, just 99p. I can see Lisa's watching. I know Lisa uh, likes to shop at Morrison's, so definitely try this one. Uh, there's loads of different flavours. This is the lowest calories and also the most nutritious. This is why I got for that one. Uh, if you can afford something a little bit more in the fridge section, they have got some uh, more higher in protein and more fresh nutrients in. Uh, but if you are on a budget and you need something in the freezer, uh, just ready to go, then uh, I, I would really recommend this because I am hungry right now. And I'm going to finish this as soon as I click finish on the video. So thank you for joining me, guys. Please leave your comment. Uh, let us know what is your favourite ready meal. Where did you find it? How much was it? What are the nutrients like? How many calories does it have? Uh, as always, give us a like. Share this video to your friends. Uh, and then click on subscribe. And you will be notified when we go live or when we upload a new video again. So thank you, Morrisons. Great choice there. I'm going to go and enjoy my dinner. Bye.